Hi everyone, it's DJ Rachel, and I figured I would take you on a quick little walkthrough of my new Pro X case for the Roland DJ707M. I love this unit. I bring it out to probably 70% of my events. It's lightweight, highly portable, tons of utility, and a great mobile DJ controller. So I wanted to get my flight case staged a little better for my workflow, and I figured I would show you some of the things that I set up with it. The first mod you'll see here is that this laptop shelf was actually cut. I am right-handed. I do like to use a computer mouse when I DJ just so I have one available if I have to search the web or download something off the laptop. I just find my workflow is a lot better than using the trackpad. I just, I'm not into it, so I like having a mouse. Now, obviously, this was really uncomfortable on my wrist, so I had it cut. Then it was filed and ground down and painted. You can actually see the the marker here from the, the cut that I made um, so that I obviously wasn't getting stabbed in the wrist. So this made this way more comfortable for me. I left it a little extended because I work either with a 15 and a half inch razor laptop and I also have a, I think it's 17 inch Asus and that butts up right to here. So no matter what laptop I'm using, it's not gonna slide off, but I'm also not gonna get stabbed in the wrist when I work, which is a good thing. My other goal was to keep as much stuff wired as possible, right? Because that cuts back on a lot of setup time if we can keep things pre-wired. So the first thing that I bought was a right angle auxiliary cord. This has a iPhone adapter. These things are like 10 bucks. I lose them all the time. So I just wanted to keep it in with the case. Need a quick little backup. I can literally plug in my phone. The cable is right here to go. I got my line level. I can throw on Spotify or a mix, reboot, do whatever I have to do if there's an issue. And I got the right angle because now I can put my front shelf on and there's clearance. It's not going to bend the cable or damage anything. I have four USBs, so I have a cable for Android stuff, I have a cable for Apple products, and then I have a couple extra USBs for something cool that I also set up. So I'll show you that. Let me get this plugged in, and we'll take a look at what I have going on. Those two extra USB ports I use for my ape coins. So when I pull out the laptop shelf, I'll turn the lights off in a second. You can see that I have two ape coins mounted on the underneath of this shelf. Now, uh, what we have here is a piece of scrap metal wrapped in black vinyl, just to make it look a little better. Just literally screwed into the bottom of the case so that this magnet had something to stick to because this isn't uh metal so and actually this is aluminum so it wouldn't stick to that either so i actually had to physically put metal under here to get these to stick but now this is the effect you get with the ape coin so this will show on the floor or any table that i'm using and it just gives a little cool effect something i think a little different to you know the dj booth or the space i thought it was pretty neat Really simple, obviously, to use, just a screw, a piece of metal, and plugged into the USB port, and the ape coins work really cool. So I thought that that was something unique, a little different. Just like all of their products, these do work with music modes, so it will pulse to the music. You can make this any color you want, full DMX capable. I just kind of have it set on color shift. I really don't go too crazy with it, but I thought that was kind of neat. Like many of us, I also have an LED strip installed here on the laptop shelf. Now, this wasn't just for aesthetics. Uh, I actually really needed this for the controller. Now, I use the MCX-8000 as well, and that thing lights up like the inside of a NASA space shuttle. This controller is a lot more subtle. The pads do light up. You know, you do have the main screen lit up, but I was having trouble really seeing what was up here. I'm going to show you what I mean. So right now I have the LED strip on. I just like it on a nice slow fade, nothing too crazy or distracting, but it does a great job of allowing me to see all the controls on the Roland. Now, when I turn this off, look at how dark it gets. As I said, all the essentials do have backlighting, but the center section was just really hard for me to view, and especially my mic inputs in the upper left-hand corner here. So I not only put the LED strip in, A, because they look cool, but B, it really made a difference in the visibility and helped a lot. 
and the remote for it velcros right to the side of the case so it's always with me never gonna lose it the last mod I wanted to show you is with my microphones. So at most of my larger events, I always have two mics, usually one wireless and one corded as a backup. This is the RE3 ND76 handheld. I usually just put that in there. That's what I hand off to guests. And then this is my backup microphone if I need it, or if I'm at a bar or a club gig, and obviously I'm not bringing a wireless microphone, this keeps it from you know rolling off the table. I don't know if you guys can see it here, but do you see how, oh, there we go. You see that dent? That is from where this fell off the table and dented. So I could have used this back then, but what I love about this is at the end when I'm ready to clean up, just pull the microphones out and this swivels in so the lid can close on top of it and it fits perfect. I literally bought this off of Amazon. I think it was $4. It came as a right angle, so I just flattened it out then with a screw, back it off a little bit so it has some swivel action to it and it folds away nice. It works perfect. So I always know where my mic is. Don't have to worry about it rolling off the table. I'm able to have a wireless unit and a corded unit and I think it's really convenient and works great. All right, so that's it. So if anybody wants any more information or links to any of the things I bought, like the cord, the power strip, the mic holder, uh, the Pro X case itself, the LED strip, the Ape coins, just let me know and I'd be happy to point you in the right direction. But this is my ultimate mobile go-to DJ controller. Love the 707M. Great unit. Thanks for watching.